So in this video, I'm going to try to do the last three of these uh, heat of formation problems. We're doing products minus reactants. So for number three, we're going to open a bracket. We have one mole. I'm going to start with CO2 gas, which is right here. Negative 393.5 kilojoules per mole. And two moles H2O liquid. So this is liquid before we use gas. So we've got to match up formula and phase. Negative 285.8 Okay. Plus Nope, we're done with that. Close the bracket. That was all of my products minus our reactants. So one mole methane CH4 gas negative 74.8 kilojoules per mole and two moles and hopefully you remember from the last one dr b oxygen is a free element and free elements are zero so we're going to cancel that okay so here let's be careful when we combine these negative 393 0.5 plus 2 times negative 285.8. So that I got the negative 2 times 285.8. Okay, that should be right. I got negative 965.1 kilojoules minus uh, negative 74.8 kilojoules and all our moles cancel out there kilojoules per mole okay minus negative 74.8 yeah negative 890.3 if yours is slightly different from rounding, that's okay. All right, this next one. Products first. Two moles. We got liquid water. Negative 285.8 kilojoules per mole. Two moles of SO2 gas. Negative 296.1. And that's all of those. So now we're ready to subtract, open another bracket, two moles, H2S gas. There it is, negative 20.1 kilojoules per mole. And three moles, but oxygen is still zero because it's a free element. So two times negative 285.8 plus two times negative 296.1. Here, negative 1163.8 and kilojoules, because all of our moles are canceling out, minus two times negative 20.1, negative 40.2, and just kilojoules there because that also cancels out. All right, whoa. So we get negative 1163.8. This is a very exothermic reaction. Negative 1, or 1122.8 and kilojoules. Last one, products. Two moles and we have NO2 gas. 33.9 kilojoules per mole. You can put the plus on there if you want to, but it's not necessary. That's the only product, so subtract. And two moles. And NO gas. Ninety point four. And one mole. 
but oxygen is a free element and it's still zero. All right, so we're gonna multiply these to cancel out our moles. I wrote a little big on this, didn't I? Well, we're gonna do the best we can. All right, two times 33.9. So that's gonna give me 67.8 kilojoules minus two times 90.4. Again, you don't have to show this much work if you don't want to. This is the line that I really need to see. So 67.8 minus 180.8. And I got negative 113. Now, on all of these, we ended up getting negative numbers. That's not necessary. That's not always the case. It is possible to do this and to get a positive number. So negative delta H of reactions are exothermic and positives are endothermic. It's just how to interpret those results.